In this video, we're going to look at some more log application problems, some with exponential growth and exponential decay. So we have our formula, f of t equals a sub 0 e to the kt, or a is equal to this. Uh, k, if k is greater than 0, it's growth. If k is less than 0, it is decay. Uh, in this problem, our a sub 0 is our original amount, our start amount. k is the growth or decay rate, and t is the time. So let's look at an example. It says the exponential model a equals 947.9 e to the point 0.022 t describes a population a of a country in millions t years after 2003. Use the model to determine the population of the country in 2003. What does the point 0.022 represent? Our first question, what, the, what was the population in 2003? Um, our formula describes the population t years after 2003. So if we want to know in 2003, then our t is 0. So we have a equals 947.9 e to the point zero zero two and our t is zero so we have point zero zero two times zero is zero e to the zero is one so our answer is going to be nine forty seven point nine million the point zero two two represents a 2.2%, so we move the decimal two places to the right to get the percent symbol, growth rate. Our next example gives us four different models of population growth for countries, and then ask us some questions about them. And this is for t years after 2006. Our first question asks, what was the population of Japan in 2006? So first you find the model for Japan. And remember our formula is t years after 2006. So this is like our example 1 because this is in 2006, which means our t is going to be 0, e to the point zero zero one times 0 is still 0, e to the 0 is 1. So this piece is 1, and so we just get 127.5 million. Our next question asks, which country has the greatest growth rate? All right, so we look at these and we want to see which of these is the highest number. So uh, 0, 1, 4, 0 0.027, 0 0.001, and our last one is negative. So the 0 0.027 is the highest one. And so for the first answer, the country is Iraq, and it's 0 0.027, so it is increasing 2.7% each year. Which country has a declining population? And that would be the one with the negative K. So this one has the negative K, and so Russia has the declining population. Our next question is the first one where we're going to have to do any math. It asks, when will India's population be 1,238 million? So we look at India's, uh, 
population, and here is their growth model. Uh, they want to know a future population, so this is going to be the A. So we have 1238 equals their A sub 0, we have 1095.4. e to the point zero one four t so the question is when so we are looking for t t is in an exponent position so this is going to take a logarithm to get it down before we can do that first we want only that term on this side so we want to get rid of this piece that's multiplied and to do that, we'll divide on both sides by 1,095.4. And we'll put this in our calculator. I'm going to round and just go to the 8, so 1.13018. Now I'm going to take the natural log of both sides to make this exponent come down. So I'll take the natural log. 1.13018 equals this exponent will come down when you take that logarithm. The ln of e is 1, so you don't need that part. And then you're going to divide on both sides by 0 0.014 to isolate the t. We'll bring up our calculator. And we'll take the natural log of 1.13018. Make sure you close the parentheses for your log. Divided by 0 0.014. Enter. And we get 8.7412. The question asks us when. Remember our original uh, problem here. The models were all t years after 2006 were these models for the populations. And so um, we could go just to one decimal place, 8.7 years, but we have to add that to 2006. Which would be 2014.7. So it happened during 2014. Uh, you'll have to just watch your questions and see, do they tell you to round um, to the nearest year? But it actually happened during 2014. We'll look at one more example. The exponential model. A equals 245.3 e to the point zero zero t t describes the population of a country A in millions of years, t years after 2003. Use the model to determine when the population of the country will be 253 million. So this will be our model. We want to know about a future population. So this is going to be the A, 253 million. And so we are again looking for T. We want to know when. It's in an exponent position, so we're going to need to take a logarithm to get it down. First of all, we'll need to divide out this 245.3 on both sides. We'll put this in our calculator. And we'll get 1.0314 if we round to four places. So now we're ready to take the natural log of both sides so that we can make this exponent come down. So we'll take the natural log of 1.0314 equals, when you take the natural log on this side, it will bring your exponent down times the ln of e. The ln of e is 1, 
So you're not going to need that. We're trying to isolate our t, so we're going to divide on both sides by 0 0.002. So we're going to take the natural log of 1.0314. Make sure you close the parentheses for your log. Divided by 0 0.002. Enter. We get 15.46 if we go to two places. So we have to add that back to 2003. So we have 2003 plus 15.46 is 2018.46. And the rest of the question says round to the nearest year as needed. I just didn't type that. So to the nearest year is going to be uh, the whole number, and so the 4-6 will drop off. So to the nearest year is 2018.